Hey y'all, so in this Tableau Pulse tip, I'm going to show you how to utilize the data guide on Tableau Cloud to help you identify Tableau Pulse use cases like the two that I have here. Pulse metrics are great because they can help your team or organization stay up to date, surfacing trends or outliers that you may not have noticed just by looking at a dashboard. So let's start by navigating to a dashboard on Tableau Cloud. And if I click this button up here, this is my data guide and you'll see a pane to the right up here, already suggesting um, a pulse metric. But so if you click on any object on your dashboard that contains a measure, the data guide will suggest a pulse metric for you to easily create. So if I go ahead and click this number up here, the data guide is suggesting that I could create a pulse metric using the data source freshness and error rate the measure or my field name, which is error rate, and then the time dimension, which is load date up to date. So by clicking this button to expand, it will actually take me to Tableau Pulse with that Pulse metric pre-built. So I already have my data source there. I have my measure and then I have my uh, time dimension. So I would just have to configure further and then put the rest of the required details but this would just take a couple of minutes. Super quick, super easy. So I hope this helps and stay tuned for more Tableau Pulse tips and feature release updates.